Thank you for watching, liking, commenting, sharing, and subscribing right now. My uh, videos uh, that uh, I've recorded with my dad sitting in the chair playing with the computer have done very well, uh, scoring thousands upon thousands of views, either his first time using a, a Mac, uh, at least as far as OS X is concerned, uh, his uh, first time with Windows 8, that one's really hit it big, over 60,000 views today. And that was just recorded last week. Insane. Uh, it went all the way to Microsoft, and not that it's you know, terribly far from here, uh, but uh, people at Microsoft ended up uh, watching it, and, and I've got word that they're not going to change a thing, which is probably the saddest part. It's definitely not funny. Uh, some people have asked, Chris, could you do a video with your dad uh, playing with Ubuntu or Linux for the first time? Uh, he's, he's going to be leaving, so I, I don't know if we're going to have a lot of time today to do it. Uh, I have installed Ubuntu on a virtual machine uh, to see if, you know, he can make his way around it. Uh, and taking a look at even, I think it was a 11.10, pretty decent experience out of the box, uh, you know, and hopefully we're seeing uh, more usability coming uh, with future editions of uh, the uh, experience uh, that uh, Ubuntu will be providing. Uh, if you've not tried uh, the beta version, uh, give it a shot. Uh, you can install it on a live CD and boot from it if you want. Uh, it, you know, that would not be a virtual machine. It would be a way that you can boot into the the Ubuntu experience from directly from the CD or DVD drive. Uh, so, you know, it's something worth trying, right? Just to know what's on the forefront. And, of course, it's free. Just like the beta version of Windows with the consumer uh, preview that Microsoft has released. We've done, uh, you know, a comparison in terms of experience, and this is really what I'm most interested in uh, if I get a chance to have my dad try Ubuntu this time around for the first time since his other videos were very popular. Um, beta Ubuntu versus beta Windows. Which one's a better experience? Are they good experiences at all? Uh, if you've tried both of them, where do you think the experience is better. We're not talking about just the raw software, the features or functionality, the experience. And think about it from a novice's standpoint, which is very difficult for geeks uh, to uh, to do. Um, Debian is the lower level version of Ubuntu, no eyesore, I mean candy, huh? Well, I know Debian, certainly, but uh, I guess Ubuntu is, the, well, Ubuntu, Mint, um, I used to love Nopix as a live CD um, you know, I've tried different uh, distros over the year. Nothing ever really jumped out at me as something that was amazingly better than what Windows could provide back then or what OS X could provide today or, or, or back when I was using it or trying it. Uh, but times change, as do operating systems. So beta Ubuntu versus beta Windows. Is it a good experience? We've done some analysis, but we're also interested in your perspective as well. Leave a comment here or in the article we've linked in the video's description.